Hi, welcome to Click for Appointment video series. In this video, we'll be talking about uh, Click for Appointment mobile app overview. In this video, we'll be covering following uh, topics patient management, appointment calendar, case sheet and prescription, treatment planning, uh, invoice management, expense management, uh, lab request management, and uh, procedure catalog, and uh, medicine catalog. Mobile app is available in both uh, Android and iOS. Uh, you can download it from Play Store and App Store. Using this app, you can manage multiple centers and you can onboard uh, multiple doctors who work in your uh, clinic and the app includes uh, notifications uh, for appointment booking uh, sharing the invoice and uh, prescription document and many more uh, notifications which are there and uh, each notification will have sms whatsapp and email we also have uh, various reports uh, available for the doctors to uh, refer. I'll be walking you through the application uh, for all the various uh, uh, features uh, which we have. Uh, in this video, we'll be covering very high level uh, in, and, and for each uh, topic, there is a detailed uh, video which is available in the YouTube. So when you log in, so this is the home interface which you get. So here you have uh, uh, option to view all your doctors who are working in your clinic and you have option to add doctors on your own. You can just add like uh, name of the doctor and uh, mobile number. Click on the save button. It will onboard the doctor. Once you onboard the doctor, you can add like uh, the image and other details about the doctors. Then you have your patient data where you can see all the patients who are added into your account and then you have the option to quickly add the patient where you can fill that uh, uh, details like uh, name and uh, gender and you will be able to save it. So it will create the new patient very easily, very quick and very easy. And then so you can tap on it and then so you can enrich all these details. So now going back to the patient profile, I just want to quickly show you one of this patient profile, how detailed it is. So when you open the patient, so you have like, let's say multiple information which are segregated for ease of use. Let's say for example, if you, when you click on this patient information, you'll be able to see the summary of the details which is gathered for the patient and uh, so you have this case sheets okay when you enter the case sheets it will be visible here by date wise and then so you have your treatments whatever you uh, the treatments which you planned those will be visible here and uh, you have prescriptions which you are done so this is visible and uh, the various documents you have uploaded for the patient will be visible here and uh, all the bills related to the patient will be visible in one place so you know what are the treatments done how much uh, uh, bill which is generated for the patient and then you have all the previous visits of the patient to your clinic so this so then you have appointment calendar where you can see all your appointments let's say if you want to book an appointment quickly so it's very easy where you can just enter name of the patient if the patient is already there it will show you the pop-up there itself and then so you select for the appointment time and then quickly select save so when you do this save it will trigger 
SMS, email and WhatsApp notification to the patient. So if you click on, yeah, you see that you should be able to see that uh, messages which are just uh, say displayed. In order to see uh, details about the appointment, you click on this any of this appointment. You'll get various options available. Uh, view patient, check in, reschedule, and uh, uh, you have the option to like update the status of the appointment, like uh, uh, complete, cancel, or no show. And then so you can do like or say book follow up appointment. And then so you can call the patient, you can WhatsApp the patient, you can send the Google review request to the patient, and then so you can send the care message, and you also have the option to send the instruction related to the post operation instruction i'll show you one of this one so you get an uh, understanding of how exactly the notification will look like let's say i'll click on this google review so when you click on it it will give the option uh, saying do you want to go for the default notification or whatsapp from the clinic let's say i'll select the whatsapp from the clinic so this will send the message from the whatsapp which is installed in this uh, mobile device so that way you know like what's a, what messages are sent and uh, patients will be able to respond to your messages. So yeah, so that is as simple as uh, say clicking a button and then sending the WhatsApp to your patient. So then you have uh, invoice, let's say you can see like what's a, all the invoices which are done for the day. Then you have the option to create a so new invoice where you can select, uh, where you can uh, add like or say the patient uh, name and uh, you can select uh, what procedure or the consultation which you want to bill right you'll be able to add multiple procedures into the list and then so you can select the payment mode and then so you can save it as simple as this one so you have the option to now edit print share and delete so if you have if you don't want to print then the best option is share the invoice where patient will be able to uh, take the print out on their own or in most of the cases they can use that uh, pdf version of the invoice for even for the reimbursement purpose also as a year also you have the option to whatsapp from the clinic So it, it, it is like what's a very convenient and easy for the staff to create the invoice quickly and share it to the patient. And you will be able to see all the invoices created for the day in the screen by default. So I will take you to this one expense management. Let's say in case you are managing the expenses like uh, uh, day to day uh, spending which you do on the uh, clinic. Right. Let's say for example, um, you are paying the rent, you can select the type as rent and uh, you can enter the vendor name. One time you need to enter, let's say next time when you try to enter the same person, so it will automatically remember. and uh, in case if you have the invoice number it's well and good otherwise it's optional thing and then so what mode you paid let's say you paid through the cash and uh, the payment status is paid so simple and what date you paid so you have both expense date and then the paid date in case if you want to put a note this is demo expense so it is now created so like this, you will be able to add all your expenses and at the end of the month, you will be able to take that as a Excel sheet. So similarly, so we have this lab request. Let's say you are partnering with uh, one or two labs for all your uh, work. So you can create the lab request. So what it will do is like it will help you to track what work is sent to which lab. and it will help you to communicate with your vendor by sending the whatsapp notification 
and you are expecting when you are expecting that work and then so let's say approximately how much you need to pay uh, to the vendor so this uh, payment will not be visible to the vendor or anybody it is only for your tracking purpose let's send it will take care of creating the message like this Now we're going back to the app. So then you have your procedure catalog. Where you can add and edit uh, the procedures which you perform in your clinic. So then your medicine catalog will be there. So some of the medicines will be pre-built and it will be available and whatever it is not there you'll be able to add on your own and then so you have this different uh, reports which are there right so you have the appointment report you have the invoice report payment report and then so there is high level summary report right so all these things are there app is very simple to use and it gil it will give you all the required details about your patients and uh, about your uh, day-to-day uh, -day, uh, operations like I'd say appointment billing and expenses and uh, lab request so it will it is like I'd say even if you are going out and then so you are carrying your information with you and then so let's say in, in case if you want to see what are my appointments uh, for the day how is the billing generated uh, in the uh, clinic today even when you are outside you'll be able to conveniently access the data in I hope uh, it was uh, informative and then so it gives you like or say high level overview of the product what it has and how much useful it is for your clinic management in case if you have any queries and you would like to contact us please refer to the uh, number which is displayed on the screen once again thank you very much for watching the video